Yep, King DDD has been revealed on the new Smash 4 updated on the website. I didn't know about this until now, as you see in the picture. Now, I'm going to talk about, you know, things on Smash 4. There have been rumors around there's going to be, you know, some characters going to be in the game, and there's going to be, a, you know, some assist trophies, too. New ones at that. Um, I'm going to go down the list, and I'm going to tell you my thoughts about it, about these rumors. Rosalina is the only Mario newcomer. Waligi and Toad were at once considered, but Waligi remains as an assist trophy, and Toad is a move for Peach. Bowser Jr., Paper Mario, and Daisy were never considered. Bowser Jr. was planned to be an assist trophy, but it was scrapped. Fallfield is a new Mario assist trophy. He acts like Mr. Rossetti, but will attack opponents at random. Diddy Kong will be the next revealed veteran to coincide with the Tropical Freeze release date. Diddy is paired with Dixie Kong as a tag team, slim, similar to Zelda and Sheik. Dixie has a separate move set from Diddy, but is still being worked on. King K. Roll is a new newcomer, the heaviest character in the game. He is a powerful and can KO light characters with two good smash attacks. His final smash has him using a bunder bus and fire cannonballs from the top of the screen while they fly in and from the sides as well. Gangplank Galleon is a stage. There is a new Zelda character, but although it's kept secret so far, the name heard the most often are Tingle and Grarahim. Garahim, Grahim, whatever his name is. Ganondorf will be buffed. Although he retains some of Captain Falcon's moves, he can equip a sword using his down special. Chrome is the Fire Emblem newcomer. He wields the Falchion and does not replace Ike. Chrome is expected to be revealed to be celebrate the anniversary of the first Fire Emblem game. Lens Assist Trophy from Brawl has been scrapped. King Gangrel and Aversa is the new Fire Emblem Assist Trophy. Gangrel runs around slicing with his sword while Aversa flies above using Aversa's knight. They are the unexpected Assist Trophy. No newcomers for Yoshi or Wario. Wario's overalls are now his default attire. The Cat and Anna assist trophy has been scrapped. Ashley from WarioWare is now a new assist trophy. Ridley is the newcomer and is scaled down a bit. It was a major feat on the development team. No new Star Fox characters. Falco is farther away from being a Fox clone. Wolf is no longer a semi clone. Villager has a female costume. Mr. Rossetti returns as an assist trophy. Tom Nook is a new assist to trophy. He apparently drops bells across the stage, which causes opponents to trip. Due to Sakurai saying tripping is removed, it is unknown if forced tripping, like this and Diddy's Bananas, will return, if only accidentally tripping is removed. Palutina is a newcomer with her moves based off of Uprising. Madness is a new assist to trophy. Act similar to Little Mac in Brawl. All Pokemon veterans from Brawl returns. Mewtwo returns. Mewtwo and Lucario have different move sets. No new Kirby characters. Meta Knight will be revealed sometime in the summer. No changes made to the Earthbound series. All missionaries characters returns like Mr. Game and Watch, Rob, Ice Climbers. Little Mac is a newcomer. He will look like the punch out reboot from the Wii. The male Wii Fit Trainer is indeed an alternative costume for Wii Fit Trainer. Wii Fit Trainer has a butt attack, but is replaced by a headbutt with a male costume. Keen Hippo is an assist trophy. The ghosts from Luigi's Mansions are an assist trophy. Solid Snake returns. Pac Man will be the final newcomer. He is a secret character. Alright, that's it. Alright. Tell you my thoughts about some of the stuff on the list. Uh, like I said, these are rumors. Some of them might not be true. I think. Well, we already know male weak fit trainer is indeed an alternative. Um, also, Jigglypuff and Ness has been also leaked by accident, so they're in the game. 
Meta Knight coming back, I believe that. Mewtwo returns. I'm not I'm not surprised by that. He probably gonna have his new form like on the Pokemon X and Y. Um Paula Paulutina is a newcomer. I guess she's from Kid yeah, Kid Icarus Uprising. Oh, 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 the queen. Yeah. Flashback. All Pokemon veterans from Brawl return. No surprise. Dixie Kong, Diddy Kong will now be like be like ice climbers, it seems, but I don't think it's just going to be only Diddy Kong. That's just my opinion. I don't think it's going to be Dixie Kong. King K. Roll looks. That was a when I saw that I was like yes, he needs to be on this game. I'm maining him if he's on this game. Uh, the Zelda characters is probably gonna be a uh, Gramahim. I think Gramahim, Grimahim, whatever his name is, Chrome for Fire Emblem. I want him to be in in the new Smash. I hope he's in there, but um, I don't know. I have a feeling they might bring back Roy. Uh, Wario coming back, yeah. The assist trophies, King Gr Gangrel in a verse or, or the new Fire Emblem assist trophy. Yeah, I see that's true. Uh, no new Star Fox characters. Well, dang it, I wanted Crystal. I wanted Crystal. And I don't think Wolf is going to be in this game. I really don't. Even though he was like my secondary in Brawl, I liked him. I think Wolf is not going to be on this fan game. Falco, yeah, he is. And I think Falco will have different movesets. And we got to look at Fox's movesets, too. I don't think it would probably be the same as Brawl, but it probably is. He probably going to have some moves that he had from Melee and Brawl mixed together. I don't know. Uh, Villager has a female costume. I think that's true. Uh, Mr. Gaming Watch, Wob, and Ice Climbers. I think that's true. They were going to ret return because you have Rosalina and Luma doing a lot of different things, controlling these two characters. But you can't put Mr. Well, not not Mr. Gaming Watch, Ice Climbers in the game. And Ice Climbers pretty much do the same thing. That don't make any sense to me. So Ice Climbers, they they're going to be in the game. Oh, uh, who else? King Hippo has an assist trophy. Snake returning? No, I don't think Snake is returning. He could to promote his new Metal Gear Solid 5 games. He could, possibly, but I doubt he's coming back. Pac Man will be the final newcomer. He is a secret character. Even though Namco is, is helping Sakurai making this game, I can see that. But I also thought that. Because there was another rumor that it was going to be an anime character from um, from Namco and Bandai. And the only two I thought about was Goku and Naruto. But I, I was I was leaning more towards of Naruto. <coughs> so, Pac-Man being the final newcomer, I won't be surprised if that is the case. Um, what else? What else? Oh yeah, Bowser Jr. could have been... He could have been a regular character. Or an assist trophy. I don't know why they scrapped him. Mangus as a new assist trophy. Hmm. I gotta see how that works. Meta Knight is returning. Lucario is returning. This don't seem so far-fetched, but... Like, again, these, ru these are rumors. That they might not be true. So, don't... Don't think these these all these lists are true, but they don't, this don't seem far fetched though. And this is coming from NeoGaf people, and you know I de I despise NeoGaf. But yeah, that's all. Tell me what you think. Link in the description if you want to check it out yourself. Stay tuned.